Hey everyone, I'm Alfred. Welcome back to Dishonored 1. Um, in the background, these two NPCs are foreshadowing the... The Heretic's brand. Which is a cool thing that I like. Um, there's an interesting way to not kill everyone, but the thing is, is that, end of, end of the day, they gotta go. You know? They gotta go, you know? Just, that's the end of it. Where are they? Um, and so it's a problem where, like... Okay, you don't want to kill anyone. Great. What good does that do anyone? This button, right. See, it's an interesting thing where, like, they gotta go, at least. Well, we can take it slower. Oh, man. Um, and so, in this game, what you do if you don't want to kill... is if that's really how it's gonna be there is something that you can do in every instance to just not kill them whatever that is <laughs> God, is there a single game where Time Stop is a power and it's not, like, the best one? Because Time Stop is always so cool. Right, these guys are actually slightly better swords. Than oh! Got too zealous. I let the alarm go off. That was my problem. Um, yeah. So there's just something in every single level to just let you get them out of there. Um, and the thing in this level is the Heretics brand. I was just reading in the archive about hmm. the People will just climb the normal way. Oh, yeah, last time I talked over it, but we can actually hear it this time. Or you can read the subs. There we go. Uh, so yeah, these are all like... I forget exactly what their deal is, but the gist is that they are uh, religious zealots. They have the authority of cops with the, uh, shall we say, sanctimoniousness of a priest. And they have a lot of power as a result. Um, but the thing is, is that that power is controlled 
Ooh, the way that he tilts it in. Gnarly. Um... Let's do a hard save here. Uh... Anyway, the way that they... Oh yeah, we can sneak in that way. That's cool. Heard something. <laughs> Brutal, but awesome. Oh, man, this would be gr uh, for such a wide level like this. This is something where dark vision is really good. Just because, like, just knowing where people are. Does that do anything? Watch it. We'll burn your ah! But anyway, yeah, the way that they maintain their power is that... End of the day, it's hard to... You know, it's hard to... What am I saying here? Um, they can just declare somebody not one of these overseers anymore. Because they have a brand that, if applied to the face, painful, obviously, um, will just say, okay, they're not an overseer anymore. And in fact, they don't have rights. Um, and in that earlier cutscene, or conversation rather... They describe the victim uh, uh, as having, like, as begging. And, like, initially, the overseers are rich. They're more rich than regular guards. And it appears that they're richer than regular priests as well. Uh, so them having to drop down to, like, begging for food and, like, people aren't allowed to help them. It's pretty extreme. Uh, there's a, I believe it's pejorative. There's a pejorative term, uh, uh, weeper, um, in the rat plague that's going on. The, uh, sufferers will leak blood from the eyes. Thus, they're called weepers. Oh, let's go ahead. Uh, yeah, they leak blood from the eyes. Thus, they're called weepers. I wanted to mention these. These wolfhounds, they have weird snouts, almost like a... like an alligator. It's kind of interesting. Okay. Oh, hey. We'll puzzle solving. Nice. I think it'd be. I, w I might like it if these things that say coin of five, coin of one, coin of ten, etc. If they. Guys, didn't you flip this switch? I suppose this one was broken off. Maybe it activates something that way. Thanks for the assist, 
Puppy. Gucci Wolf. What's with this dog? Goodness. Okay. I might like it if these things that say coin of five, coin of ten, or whatever. If they were like, um, labeled, uh, uh, in a funny way. Like if they said, like if they said this is an emperor, this coin is a queen, you know? Like crowns and nobles and commons and stuff. Lying tongue, wandering gaze, iron mind. Oh yeah, I'm in a new location now. One moment. Run free, little vermin. The city is yours. Hey, we're back. Sorry about that. My wife was calling. <sighs> right, yeah. He didn't even say hello. Yeah, you're... You're just some guy. As near as I can tell. There's something I've always wanted to do. One of, I think, the coolest things in any game is in Metal Gear Solid 2, every single character is named. Like... Every single character is named. Every single random NPC has a name. Now granted, you know, they aren't a special name. Yoink. You know, they're just some miscellaneous, you know, guy or whatever. The thing is, is that they at least put in the work to put a name to every face, you know? And, and like, the idea that every single one of them... Wandering gaze, lying tongue, restless hands. Notes. Lying tongue, wandering gaze, errant mind. Two, one, seven? Should? Should be? And then this will be the under. Right down here. I don't see Campbell's journal anywhere. This is following him. If he catches us in here, I've told you a hundred times. Campbell is upstairs. I love that it has an additional, um, like notification for like if you're if you're crouched and if you're like double hunched over crouched that's great where the overseas gone they wade through chest high waters with their hounds this heart may or may not be the heart of the empress um it shares a voice actress with her Um, in this game, it was one of those, like, open secrets where, like, everyone knows it, but nobody, like, outright said it. Where the Empress and Corvo were having an, uh, a relationship. 
of a romantic or sexual nature, to be clear. Um, I don't mean that they were just friends or anything, because that's evident. Um, and then there's another implication that Corvo's... Uh, uh, Emily is Corvo's daughter. Um, the girl who was captured. All right, let's hope that this works out. So yeah, if we wanted to, we could, it is possible to, I love that he even gives you additional time to be like, oh, hold on, let me bumble around. Let me get the right key. Blah, blah, blah. They're not at this one, right? Nope. Okay, cool. Keep each other entertained. Time. What? See something? <laughs> nice. When I find you, it's gonna be sad. Attention. This facility is now in high alert. Lockdown is now in effect. Report to your stations and execute Damn, I was totally gonna kill that guy. That's why I put a mine down, because I was hoping that both of them would be killed. Next one. Attention. This facility is now in high alert. Lockdown is now in effect. Report to your stations and execute. I've gotta say, now that there's like four or five shows that are predicated like wholly entirely on like kill dad and his daughter or miscellaneous magical mysterious child i think the idea of like corvo being in a show would be kind of cool though god there have been so many video game shows recently on average i would say that the video game shows are better than like any video game movie Oh yeah, so it's possible to grab a whole bunch of, um... It's possible to find all these things before they show up. Yoink. Just chunks of meat. Yeah, I totally plan to kill, uh, uh, to kill... What's her name? Callista? Did that say Innsmouth? This game takes place in, a, in an area called Dunwall. Which is very similar to a Lovecraft area called Dunwich, which I believe is actually Dunnish because of the nonsense words that English works on. By, by English, I mean fake English, you know, the ones that the British speak. Sleep. Facility is now in high alert. Lockdown is now in effect. Report to your stations and execute any intruders on site. Man, when you're like actively fighting dudes, you can pull bullets back so quickly. Alright, I really gotta find this rune. Maybe I've misspent my things and I should have, uh, Attention. This facility is now in high That's alert. Interesting. Lockdown Spaced. is now in effect. 
Report to your station. Backyard. Hmm. Yeah, I want to get this rune first. Um. Two, 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 two. I think about Mando being killed, Dad. You know, Mando from the show Attention. Mandalorian. I feel like Facility that that could just be the name of the genre, you know? Lockdown kill Dad. Is now in Report to your stations and when you're just a dad and you kill people. It was something I feel like um, Witcher could have pushed a little harder. Hmm. Damn. Um, I enjoyed like maybe ten minutes of Witcher. Attention! This facility is now in high alert. It's also Lockdown just like now it's a very alert. very hard Report show to just like actually enjoy. Any intruders on site. Oh yeah, we can actually spoil this and and throw the glasses everywhere to make sure that nobody gets poisoned. I think we can actually do a poison chalice swap. And we can uh, move the move the cups around. That's something I don't think I've ever done. Because the thing is, is that that still kills the man. Attention. This facility is now in high alert. But yeah, what you do is Lockdown you is drag him here. You Report strap him into this chair. Execute any intruders on site. Maybe not this chair. Maybe it's a chair. No, maybe it's. I think it's this one. And then you brand his face, and then. Well, sorry, no questions asked. You know, that's the problem whenever you have a punishment that's no questions asked. Because then you can't ask questions. Attention! This facility is now in high alert. Like, obviously, the actual case is... You know, some guy broke into the building, branded my face, claimed that I was a heretic. And the problem is, is that because of his, you know, break into the building, he was able to clarify and verify every single thing that does indicate that you are a heretic. But I'm not a heretic. Even though every single pot, like, proper channel has been followed in Attention. order to mark me as one. But no questions are asked, so... To your and any That's tough for that guy. This was when I was really close. And I know it's in here. Maybe I go around from like here? Oh, jumping around here. I don't name moi. Okay, now I hear you. Attention! This facility is now in high alert. Lockdown is now in effect. Report to your stations and execute any intruders on site. Again, the um the character design is really showing its legs here. Because these character designs are so reminiscent of Half-Life 2 soldiers. Hi there. This way leads to Sammy? Or no, this is the way back. Isn't it? Because this... No, that leads to the backyard as well. Huh. Never gone this way. Yeah. So is it through here? Because I don't want it to be a possession thing. Because I'll be kind of pissed if it is. Because I literally just took rats instead of possession. And like, there were some rats around, so I don't need to like, make my own rats. So where am I in relation to this? Sixty-four. 
And that leads to the kennels. I don't think it shows runes loaded in other areas. Yeah. Because they... Oh! They stripped off the, all the meat off of them. Two, one, seven, was it? All right. Oh, boy. You're free, rats. Go nuts. Chew, chomp, whatever you wish. God, I'm all full up on everything. I guess I'll top off. I like that people use sleep darts as, like, what appears to be actual sleeping medication. Or alternatively, sleep darts are just a sleeping medication that has been put into a dart. Man. I do this all the time where I'm like, yeah, I'll play this game on hard mode. And, like, that's a great way to get myself in high tr into, into trouble. Yeah, I think I just I'll need uh possession later. Now in effect. Report to your stations and execute any intruders on site. Attention. Cuz the quickest way would be like through the floor, but that's not an option for me because I'm a man and not a rat. Report to your stations and execute Oh man, I can't wait until I can get double jump. There are, is almost like no game where double jump is not the best. Double jumping is just fun. There's something about it. Granting you more air control is just always good. Also, I love that they call it the blue potion in loading screens. You will be dead because of me. Sorry. <laughs> I gotta do more. I gotta do more evil stuff. I keep letting people live and I let that other guy live. Sorry, I gotta do more evil things. This is a high chaos playthrough. One thing about stealth games is that, like, as long as the stealth works and it's good and it's fine, and in fact the stealth is fun as well, I feel like I will always be able to do a hard mode playthrough. I feel like this is a really weird part of the level. Because, like, there's so much of a denouement here. Like, shouldn't the level be over? Yes. Like, maybe it's just because this is the first level and, like, you haven't upgraded your sprint or your blink or anything. But, like, this feels like this part of the level is, like, so weirdly, like, extraneous almost. You.
Reading people's mail. Let's do one of these, huh? Has somebody made an out of Corvo's world? Um, I mentioned that JoJo's fighting game earlier. Oh, is this the unique kill? Yep, it is. Um, in addition to... Uh, yeah, in the JoJo's fighting game... Cool and great. I feel like it's so hard to use grenades because, like, how often are you actually, like, he dropped it. That's awesome. I didn't know you could do that. I was just, I just happened to be sliding and I happened to shoot him in the foot. Because also he heard, uh, uh, he heard the fight from earlier. Ah, over here. Damn, you got me. Oh, it's in this little vise here. God, I'm just eating all these rats. I'm sorry, my rat brothers. I mean, if I could open this... There a uh, hello? Because I kind of would have thought I would have been able to pick that up from the table. Yeah, I'm starting to notice why uh, there were so many. That was really weird. They just sort of didn't let me get it. Maybe I'm being like cursed with bad luck for killing that girl and her brother. Well, back to killing. Right over here is that bone charm. Missed me that time. Let's do a save, huh? Okay, 
So yeah, it just straight up didn't let me grab it. That's weird. That's super unusual. There's something just that just feels good about running on, on rooftops. I am pretty pleased about this game's like level of speed as well. That might be worth checking out. This would be another time when Dark Vision would actually be useful. You know, for my kill playthrough. Because ordinarily, uh, I mentioned this earlier, but you use dark vision specifically to not kill people. This is another like weird instance where like um Right, this thing. Hmm. I don't think they can get in. How strange. Go, my brothers. I love when the head goes flying. Go, my brothers. I didn't even know that they actually had a unique kill for that, honestly, for the dogs getting you. That's kind of interesting. The thing is, is that I definitely do want to get, um... <laughs> Love the flourish as well. Plague, you say? This kind of sucks when playing on PC, I just realized. Like, I hate playing on PC and there is something in your left hand and you right click to use it. That hurts me, you know? Like, it is so, so, so much cleaner to just be on console and right hand is, is right trigger, you know? I might actually kill enough people to justify using that, um... Is this also 217? That's unlikely, right? Where are you? 
Hmm. We'll find it. Right. Can't block that. Where's that going to put me? Oh. Right. One moment, everyone. I'll be right back. Next time. Bye. See ya.